In the year 2012, my Pacific Island youth will surpass their popularity, topping the charts. They will grow in numbers in heaven. In 2012, my Pacific Island youth will outbeat their own statistic of 2007 by two children in a season. 31 Pacific Island teenagers will take their own lives in a single year. Sahara Luciane Fifita. I felt your picture stapled to the door of my temple as my lungs cracked a tsunami of tears. Waves that could not break the floodgates of your memories. I heard lightning struck the hearts of your classmates, and their songs could not paint your beauty to justice. See, I spent every night reading every single word from our weeping community. The memoir of your grace has brought our attention to unity. Sahara, do you know that your name has brought our own kingdom to its knees? Princess Frederica Duita expressed that she was full of sorrow, her condolences to your family. Sahara, wrap your angel wings around our islands. Give warmth to our children. Tell them they will no longer sleep in silence. We are speaking. Sahara, tell them that every time they choose life, they are choosing light because they are worth every Pacific sunrise. Sahara, we are listening. See, when I wrote this poem, it was in the form of a prayer with my heart so heavy, but my hopes so high. And when I wrote the name Sahara, I wrote it in a place of all things sacred. I laid it in an envelope and addressed it to my niece, 12 years old, Sandra. I want you to know you are a princess of royal bloodline. Take a look at this name. This girl was 15 years old, Tongan, just like you. She took her own life. There are a million teenagers like her that will take their own lives every year. Sandra, 31 of those children will be your brothers and your sisters. Be strong for them. Be loud for them. And if the world gets too damn heavy for you to carry, Auntie is here. And I'm listening. Yeah.